Ooh, what's going on guys, it's your boy DPJ here today with another Story. Destiny video and in today's Destiny video I'm going to run you guys through my Prison of Elders loot results for the past week. Now this past week I have had a super busy week outside of YouTube in real life doing all sorts of crazy shit so I haven't had that much time to actually play Destiny. I only managed to run the Prison of Elders on two of my characters. Didn't get to run it on my Warlock, also didn't even really get to take part in the Trials of Osiris. I did it a couple of times, had one or two games in it and I just I just wasn't feeling it this week. I didn't really like the map. Um, I only got to rank 5 with the Iron Banner on one of my characters which took me literally, well I did it on the last day basically, the last couple of days I got to rank 5. Didn't have time to run it on my Titan and on my Hunter either. Uh, but I did run the Prison of Elders on my Titan and on my Hunter and I'm going to get straight into that. Starting with my Hunter on a level 32, I got an Armor Core, I got 3 Mounts of Light, I got a Token of Judgment, I got 3 Strange Coins, I got the Kale Hunter's Hood Class Item and her Benevolence Queen Sniper Rifle. You know, to be honest, I'm seeing more and more people using this Sniper Rifle in PvP as of late, with some amazing mods on it too. I may just re-roll this, try and get a decent set of mods on it. Moving on to the 34, I got a Weapon Core, I got a Ferret Light, I got 5 Relic Iron, I got seven strange coins, I got a treasure key, I got three mots of light, I got a cow hunter's hood again, and I got the Hygia Norbacy Queen Scout Rifle. Moving on to the 35, I got a token of flight, I got a special ammo pack, I got a royal amethyst, I got an armor core, a weapon core, and a ferret light, five spin metal, four mots of light, a treasure key, the cow hunter's hood again, the her courtesy queen shotgun, and the Hildian Seeker ship. So not bad to be honest, I mean, to be honest I don't know what we queen weapons I do not have. At the time of running it with my Hunter, I think the one I was looking for was the Rocket Launcher, which was the one I currently didn't have. Moving on to my Titan and starting with the 32, I got an Armor Core, 7 Strange Coins, 5 Helium Filaments, a Token of Identity, 3 Molts of Light, a Royal Amethyst, the Payment 6 Queen's Pulse Rifle, and that was it. Moving on to the 34, I got a Ferret Light, an Armor Core, 2 Strange Coins, 5 Molts of Light, the Mark of the Cow Slayer class item, and the Dream Waker Rocket Launcher, which was the one weapon I did want, also completing a part of my Exotic Bounty 2. Moving on to the 35, I got my first elemental primary weapon drop, which I'll show you guys in a second. From the treasure room, I got an Ephemeric Light, I got an Armor Core, a Weapon Core, 6 Monster of Light, 5 Helium Filaments, Mark of a Castellar class item again, I got the Wolves Bane Queen's Heavy Weapon, and I also got the Hildian Seek Ship again. Now the weapon I had dropped was the Wolves Leash Scout Rifle, after an Arc Burn, same mods as the standard one, which I do already own, which I will dismantle now, I've got this one. Now the thing that stands out most about this Scout Rifle is how quick it shoots. I mean it shoots pretty fast, a lot like the old school Crucible B-Line Trauma Scout Rifle. I've also been told as well this thing is a beast in PvP, but that's something I'll just have to check out for myself. I mean I can see it being pretty powerful and it's got that super high fire rate, so I'll check it out and let you guys know. But guys that is what I got from running the Prison of Elders and both my Hunter and my Titan like I said. Haven't had much time to play Destiny this past week, been so busy with in real life shit. But this week now I am going to grind the hell out of it. Hopefully try and get the few missing exotics I don't have and a few other things too. What did you get from the Prison of Elders last week? Let me know down below in that comment section. Thanks for stopping by as always and peace out until next time. Peace!